this is Calvin from Hill Country Building and Renovation, HCBR for short. Today I'm at our uh, lake house uh, project. This is coming along very nicely. We got a little rain going outside, so I'm just going to do an inside video today, and tomorrow I'll do an outside. So here is the entry. Do a little bit of outside video. Here's our entry. We moved the garage door over, and we've got uh, some of the uh, cornice painted, the soffit and fascia. And this engine you hear behind me, this is the texture machine. So we're inside texturing today, which is a really good thing. So this entry was moved, see this line across here, the front door used to be right here in front of where the stairs are. And the stairs was going the other direction, up to the upstairs, which we completely demoed, took the complete roof off. So we reframed this entry, so we now have a uh, entry closet, and then an existing uh, bedroom here, took out a window over there on the other side, and we lifted the ceiling in the entry, which is really awesome. Very nice uh, feel on the entry. And then vaulted the entry all the way up to the second floor. So down here is the existing house. We have the laundry room in here. We're replacing the sheetrock on the ceiling because it was... Uh, Actually, it wasn't sheetrock, it was paneling. So, after we took the roof off the house, of course, it started to rain. We had a couple of uh, leaks. We did really well. We didn't get too bad. And uh, this bedroom here, we put in a window. And uh, we had someone actually step through the sheetrock while they were working upstairs. So we repaired the sheetrock. A couple of leaks here that we had. Not too bad. Didn't get really wet. So we're going to patch those. And uh, we use bleach and kills oil base to uh, cover those spots. And then this is the master bedroom. So we replaced the window here and put in... Uh, a new window here and a new window over here on this side and then also put in a new slider patio door so that's the downstairs we didn't do anything in the bathroom didn't do anything in the kitchen we did however replace these three windows and there were two windows here that we took out completely. So going down the hall here, it's a little noisy upstairs because of the uh, texture machine. But here's our new stairs. Here's a new balcony which is open to the entry downstairs. This room here is a storage room and we'll have double doors. Here's a new bathroom. Here's our texture guy. We're really happy that he's here. Looking very, very good. And check out this room, this new family room. This portion of the house had no upstairs. This was previously the roof system for the house. So we took off the roof. We put in new engineered ceiling joists to span all the way across. And then on the ceiling, we used scissor trusses to give it a vault. So in this area here, we will have our kitchenette. And then going down the hallway here, we have a bedroom here, 
with a closet and a bedroom here also with a closet. Okay, so in addition to that, check out this patio door. It is huge and it opens up onto a new deck that we are in the process of uh, building with a cover over it. Hey Marco, you want to turn? And as you can see, we use LVLs, which is a laminated veneer lumber for all our beams here. This is very strong. Actually, it's uh, probably overbuilt a little bit. And uh, we also use plywood on the ceiling rather than, go ahead, go ahead. We use plywood on the ceiling rather than wafer board. because we are going to stain everything on this deck. We use pressure treated six by six posts from here all the way down to the ground, all the way down there. So it's extremely strong. And then we'll have our mason out here probably next week. And these columns are going, going to be rocked from floor all the way up here to the ceiling. So this is going to really be a nice feature. I mean, it's a little hard to see the lake out there because it's uh, kind of hazy. We got a little bit of rain today. So this is going to be a nice, nice spot. Okay, so that is the inside of the house at this point. So the question is, what is your next awesome project and how can we help you with that? You can see our project highlights on our website, which is www.hcbrtexas.com.